Hi everybody, it's Heavy Dobby and I'm reporting on my VLCD8. Um, I have started round six and wanted to give you a weekly report. Um, I have to make this really quick because I've got company that's going to be walking in the door any minute and for dinner and so I don't want to be vlogging when they walk in. Anyway, real quickly, I uh, did a little uh, vlog just a few minutes ago, I think, um, on just my, you know, return into the uh, atmosphere of the HCG um, YouTube family. So, um, before I get into my, well, no, let me do my stats first. Um, I started this round uh, loading on a sa on Saturday, January 5th and 6th. Started VLCD number one on January 7th. Um, today is my eighth day. Um, I loaded dirty, and but I did. I what I did was though I ate a lot of fat, like lots of macadamia nuts and lots of coconut cream to make like a chocolate mousse, and then I ate just whatever, but uh, just lots and lots of fat. But some of it was dirty. Um, you know, I had some chips and stuff like that. Uh, I lost. I lost pa I lost some weight during my load, so I didn't have anything to get off originally. Um, and so I started my VLCDs, and as of this week one, I am down 9.7 pounds. I started my loading uh, start on January 5th was 266.6. And I am 256.9. I think it's 9.7. So I'm so terrible at math. Anyway, it's 9.7. 266.6 minus 9.7, whatever that is, that's how much I weigh today. Which I wanted to share with you is a, around a pound or two of what I weighed in July. So I have been pussyfooting for not only since July, but before. So since July, I gained, I gained about 10 pounds. Um, so I have just been a very, very bad example for everyone. As far as, I am not one that just takes weight off, gets it off, and keeps it off. I have been obese since I was eight or nine years old. So this, you know, I'm almost 56. So I've got some issues to deal with. Um, and one of them is disappearing, if you haven't figured it out yet. I um, have never been a person who can consistently keep up a relationship, keep up a habit, keep up um, a hobby. The only thing that I have kept consistent, um, and I think that's just because God expects me to, and I expect that I'm going to do it, is my, re my relationship with my immediate family um, and my husband which uh, we celebrated 25 years. But other than that, if I can get out of it, I do. And I, and I have to figure that out. But anyway, long and short. Um, so I'm back. I don't... And you know what? I'll be gone a while again some other day, sometime. But I really feel like since this has been an issue for me uh, with weight, that I'll be back. Because here's the why. HCG is the answer. I, you know how you go stepping and go from, you know, lily pad to lily pad, trying to find a new protocol or a new diet or something new. I know without a doubt that the HCG protocol is the way that I want to lose all of my weight. And um, I've never had a second, second thought about that. So those of you who are considering HCG, your, your um, search stops here. This is the way to do it. Um, so what I, I also wanted to mention that I've noticed the YouTube community, uh, you kind of go in ebbs and flows um, with topic and with um, habits and conversations and whatnot. And when I kind of did my disappearing act, a lot of people were getting comments from this one stalker who was changing their name every day and pretending to be someone else and really giving the HCG YouTube community a lot of grief. And that 
was part of my um, resistance at the time too. And so it seems like that person is gone, but what I have noticed is there are a lot, and I mean a lot, who have switched over or have started RX. Uh, it was mostly, last time, six months ago, it was mostly um, homeopathic. Whether that's good or bad, the only thing I wanna say about the difference between the two is my experience is that those who have done RX and have done H, H, you know, have done um, homeopathic before. I think the difference is the inches and the way they um, disappear more so with the RX. For me, with my 10 pound, 10 ish pound, um, you know, increase and then back down, I noticed that um, the inches are more than the pounds should be. So I gained some weight and didn't gain inches and then all of a sudden I started going poop and I and the inches are amazingly in, have increased. So I think your body kind of gives you some grace for a little while and then when you've just pushed it too far that's when the inches come back on. So um, yeah, HCG is pretty cool, isn't it? All right, um, all right, this is way too long, so I'm gonna let you go. I will be back, I promise. Um, and here we go, I'm doing good. Week one down, week two in the beginning. Anybody wanna join us? Come on. <laughs> all right, take care, bye.